Hi folks, co-tutor here and my name is Anil Deshpande. So having understood this, the next part is context renaming. Context renaming is nothing but can I rename it with something else. So wherever it is being used, you can rename it. But however, wherever this is being used, you can't. So let's understand this through a demo. For example, here I can write current person and wherever it is there, I can use current person dot h because at the end of the day, it is like using a it within a lambda function. I can do the same with also. I can write current person arrow function and then use this. But however, I can't do same wherever I am using this. It is not making any sense at all to use reference renaming. That is just like what we did with it. I cannot do the same with situations where I have to use this. There is one more minor part that you need to understand that is whether null check is possible or not. What do you mean by null check? If the object is of nullable type, can I put a null check using these scoped functions? In case of let run apply and also you can do that. You can put a null check. But however, with respect to with, you can't do that. I will show you why it can't be done. So let's have a very quick demo. Let's assume that all of these are of nullable person and what I will do is I will comment it out and put null. I will comment it out. So basically what I did is I have made all these variables nullable and I have initialized them with the null. Now can I write something like let variable put a null check and then write a let. Of course I can write. I can do the same here as well run variable put a null check run it doesn't matter what i write inside run but can i put a null check before i do the run yes can i do the same with apply variable yes you can do that and then you have also variable you can do the null check with also as well now what about with you have with variable can i write with with variable and i can write something here but can i write null check here no you can't there is no option can i write it like it here that is also not possible so basically what i am trying to emphasize is it's not possible to do the null check in case of with however you can do that with everything else that was the part of last line of table that you were seeing a moment earlier so having understood this this table can still be very confusing that is the reason why I have basically created a simple decision tree for you to follow when you are working with this scope functions. The first decision that you have to make is do you want to return a result or an object? Well, if you are sure that you want to return an object, then you have no other option but to use apply and also. But under apply and also, there could be two more options. Do you want to use it or this? If at all you want to use this within the context of the scope function body, then you have to use apply. Otherwise, if you want to use it, you have to use also. So that is one part of the decision tree. The other part of the decision tree is you don't want to return an object. You rather want to have a free control over returning whatever that you want. That is returning a result. In that case, go with let run and with. Here is a, another decision. Do you want to use it or this? If at all you want to use it, you have to use let. But if you want to use this, then you have to use either run or with. That is, you want to return a result and you want to use a this. And once again, the next question is, is doing a null check very important for you? If it is not so important, then you can use with. But if it is important, then you have to use run. I hope this decision tree will help you to use the scope functions in a very easy manner. So that's it. We will meet you in the next video with another That brings topic. us to the end of this particular video. Don't forget to like, comment, share the video and subscribe to the channel. Take care. Bye.